<laughs> this is not a tutorial, but it is a comment on this trendy effect, the VHS look. More specifically, the CRT TV look. I've seen this everywhere. Some might argue it might be a little overused. I don't know. But uh, I still have a soft spot for it. This is an effect that I sometimes still use. You can buy a pack or a preset to put this look over on top of your footage, but I've updated my methods and I actually do use a CRTV. So I wanted to show you what that process looks like because it's definitely more involved than just taking a plug in and dropping it on your footage. This is a full overhaul. This is taking this footage, destroying it, and putting it back into your edit. There's a couple different things you need to do this, but most importantly, you need this. And of course, you need a TV. This this one will do. Oh. This is the secret. It's a well. It's called a, delu a deluxe video distorter mixer slash fader. Uh, it's a circuit bender, so this goes in between the signal from the laptop or computer and the TV. So this literally becomes a second monitor, a display monitor for your computer. And then we can record this screen with this camera. The reason I think I like this effect so much and the reason others like this effect so much is because of the same reason I like my coffee mug that I use every morning. So this is my favorite coffee mug and as you can see it it looks imperfect you know it has this design one might call a, a wabi-sabi design it looks unique but it's actually not because this is from world market and it was manufactured to look this way and I think that is the age that we're living in right now with digital media is manufactured in perfection we have all these perfectly crystal clear images yet there are creators who are purposely downgrading their footage. So it's not a perfect science and uh, I'm not by no means the best at doing this. And the point is that it's supposed to be gritty. So uh, what you want to do is basically capture as much of the screen as possible and then make sure your room is as dark as possible. Now we're ready to bend some circuits. So you just want to run through whatever you're recording a few times and take your circuit bender and just See what looks good. You have this big dial which changes the intensity of whatever setting you're on. You know, on this setting here, this is more of like a luminance, I would say. So, you know, we're brightest, we're going, we're bringing like the shadows down. Then if we switch like this, it almost, it's, it's almost like the same thing, but it creates this weird like almost matte look to the image, which is kind of crazy. And then you have another somewhat of a luminance setting. I don't really know. Whoever made this, please just, can you tell me what it does? I don't really understand it. And then of course, you have the famous glitches. How a CRTV works is there's a laser shooting across the screen. And so when we're doing this, we're interrupting that process. And it looks all distorted and really crazy, bro. And depending on which setting you're on, you're going to get a slightly different look. So basically what we want to do is we want to record a few different times. Some with the glitches, some with just, you know, messing with some of these other settings. And then we can make some decisions later on in the edit. Our lives are more and more digitized and we don't have things to, to touch and feel with our hands. And I feel trapped by that in a way. So I think this is almost like an attempt, a desperate attempt to crawl back to the age where this was the technology that was, was prevalent. You know, it takes us back to this nostalgic time. You know, the creators that are using this effect are of the age where 
this technology was being used when they were experiencing movies and TV for the first time. Is this the, is this the TV one that makes the TV? Yeah. It gives video a nostalgic grittiness that's just uh, hard to come by in a digital world. Plus, it just looks cool. <laughs> All that's left now to do is edit it.